nigga lean it, now you swerving Hit the plug, free up for another serving Push it, push it, roll a pound and blow it down Push it, push it, roll a pound What a night for a fight! Under the lights, my name is Todd Grisham We are here at the Empire Fight Camp Alongside me is Johnny Nelson The pleasure's always mine, my friend It's time for our tale of the tape it's Sugar Ray Leonard, five foot nine inches tall with a 70.5 inch reach. And he'll be facing tonight Sugar Ray Robinson. Weighed in at an even 147 pounds. He's five foot 11 inches tall. One has the height, one has the reach. Then when you've got a fight like that, you've got to get cold and personal. Drag him into your kind of fight. Stick to that chest. If you don't, you're going to get popped off. You're going to get guided around the ring and then shot at a distance. Gotta keep it close to that. Sugar Ray Leonard, an undisputed welterweight champion, and he won world titles in five weight classes. Sugar Ray Robinson, one of the most skilled boxers to ever lace up the gloves, inducted into the International Boxing Hall of Fame in 1990, and he fights out of Harlem, New York. You can hardly hear yourself speak. The fans are going mad for this. Well, Johnny, anything can and will happen here in boxing. Let's see what happens. This bout is scheduled for 12 rounds of boxing. In the red corner, presenting one of the all-time greats, the Hall of Fame legend of boxing, a five-division champion of the world, Sugar Ray Leonard. They'll be fighting under the lights tonight. What a unique environment as we get set for this high-energy showdown. The clouds have held the rain back. It's getting breezy, it's getting darker. The fans are getting desperate. They want to get involved in this fight. And now, the action's about to begin. Athletes have been waiting a long time to square off. Here we go. He threw the hook, didn't land. Danced with the devil under the pale moon, and they're down. Would be wise here to take the full eight seconds. Seconds of the round, and he is looking really sharp. As bad as boxing judging can be sometimes, there's no doubt who won that round. Dominance, without a doubt, makes it look so, so easy. Like a 
The referee calling for seconds out, right back in the action. Here we go, round two. Who's going to land the first big shot? He just misses with that big right hand. Him with that uppercut. What are they thinking? That's clearly illegal. We wanted action, and they are deliberate. Gets out of the way of that left hand. Changes from both men in this round. That's another scoring shot. He misses with that jet. relies a lot on their instincts and reaction time. You've got to get in there quick to punch your opponent before he gets his fist back to block. To be a counter puncher, you've got to take them out of their pace. Do not wait for them, because if you wait, they'll pepper and pop you all night long. Rush them. This round still up for grabs with just 10 seconds to go. Gym. At least for once, this is on TV. Thousands around the world saw that shot. They probably even heard it.